So what kind of problems are you solving that other 3D printers aren't solving? Yeah, so there are a lot of sacrifices that users of 3D printers uh, have to make, uh, particularly engineers and product designers, in speed and material properties, color, safety, software complexity, and so many other things. And so our unique technology, augmented polymer deposition, which we patented, solves all of those problems. At the same time, we're jetting uh, functional inks that can change the material properties of the thermoplastic at the voxel, which is a 3D, pix, uh, 3D pixel, at the voxel level. And that enables a myriad of, of capabilities. In our first machine, it enables um, color, text, and images, detailed text and images on, on parts, right. uh, which is useful. It also enables... So you're painting, are you painting that on the outside or are you injecting it with the material? It's actually injected with the material, so it, it's below the surface as well, so that if you scrape or the part or anything like that, it will still be there. Um, and the, the other thing that, that it's doing in today's 3D printer for, for us is uh, zero post-processing. Every 3D printer right now requires hours and hours of messy, toxic post-processing that can't be done in the office. It has to be done in a lab. So we've developed a zero post-processing uh, technology where the ink that's, uh, that's released is between the part and the support. It's jetted by voxel between the part okay. and the support. And it enables just instant release at your desk with your bare hands in seconds. So does that mean it's actually weakening the part in those little pieces so you can tear it off easier? It is. It's called release one. Okay. And it actually repels the bond between the part and the support. Huh. So it just enables you to quickly snap the support off in your hands.